I do not know, my little ones. The bamboo is almost all gone. And that's our food. There's only one thing we can do. We need to call for help. <laughs> there, finished. Now, oh, what are those two? Trouble, Samson. I've had an emergency call from a giant panda. Giants? Ooh, I don't like the sound of that. They're a gentle big beasties, black and white and furry all over. They live in China, and there's no many left about. So, Samson, what's the problem? Someone is cutting down the bamboo, and bamboo leaves are all they eat. Is Fifi here yet? Not today, laddie. Fifi's on holiday. But how are we going to get to China? Suck! Pardon? Samson's instant catapult kit. Have you got your Chinese kit bag? Yes, Samson. Ready for takeoff? Ready. I do hope Fifi's back soon. Three, two, one! <laughs> soft landing just like jumping into bed they must have soft earth around here Zip! <gasps> what's happening it must be an earthquake no I'm not who said that me I'm so glad you dropped in I'm ping pong the giant panda thank you for coming so fast our pleasure Zippy and Zack the two can text when you ask for the best You've got to make do with us. Thank you, Zack. So, have you any idea who could have taken your bamboo? Well, all we could hear was, ha ha ha, -ha and this is going to be fun. Mm. Come on, Zack. It's clue finding time. Hello, hello, hello. What's all this then? Aha! A white tail feather. Does that mean we've got to the bottom of the case? Not yet. But I think I know who's behind it. This way, Zack. Shh. Can you hear that? Yes. The trouble is, I can't tell where it's coming from. Hmm. Let's look in the bag and see what Samson packed for us. Aha! What are you doing? It's a surprise. Just you wait and see. Am I going to like it? Not a lot. Oh. I'm joking. You'll love it. You'll feel on top of the world. Zippy! Zippy! What do I do now? Use the telescope. Oh. Uh, yes. Nothing. 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 Now that looks like good fun. Well, anything to report? Nothing much, Zippy. Just a bunch of silly ducks having a great time on an adventure playground. Was it, by any chance, made of bamboo? Yes. Come to think of it, it was. That's it. It's the mad ducks at work again. Mad ducks? Don't worry. I've already got a plan up my sleeve. Up your sleeve? It's in the bag. Sorry. 
Is it up your sleeve or in the bag? It's all in the bag. Just have a look. <laughs> Zippy! Zippy! A monster's trying to eat me! Have you quite finished fighting with my oriental dragon costume? You mean... it's not real? No. Well, thank goodness! I was just about to... Zack, of course you were. Now this is what we do. Right. Follow me. Oh! Ow! This way, Zack. What way? I can't see a thing. What are we going to do? Sit here and think of a new plan. Quick! Here I come! Last one to the tops, a toucan! Not me! I'll beat you easy! <laughs> a ghost! It's a monster! It's a duck eating dragon! Quick! Let's make a run for it! I've got a better idea! Let's make a fly for it! There must be something we can do. My mind's a blank. I've got it. We can... Ah! Don't eat me! Don't eat me! Zack, it's only me. Oh. Well, we've got the dragon back. So let's get back to work. Thank you. Thank you. You did it. Did, did what? Ah, such modesty. Look, the strange birds have flown. And we have enough food here to last us until the new bamboo grows. But... Thank you again. Goodbye, my friends. Well, Zack, I don't understand. Neither do I. But seeing all those pandas eating has made me ever so hungry. Me too. Let's go home. <laughs> Well, that's a strange tale, McNormistic. Zack, opening the kit bag and finding the dragon was so funny. I was just caught off guard, that's all. You thought it was real. I never did. Well, not much anyway.